last year. I think this year you came in. You guys knew you were in. It was just now. We're just waiting on the seat. Does it feel different yet? Yeah, I think so. I think it's last year. We were like, man, it's our first time. What's gonna happen? But now we kind of know what's gonna happen. Like getting on the bus and stuff like that. So you know, it's a little, it's a, it's a little different. Well, for us, not for the freshmen. How do you feel about Texas? You know much about them yet? No, I know they got the one guard. Jacoby. Yeah. I know him, he's real good. Nick says he's glad they're a big name team because you'll get up to play. <laughs> That's probably true. <laughs> How different do you feel about what you guys can do in the tournament because of what you guys did in New York? Does that make you believe a little bit more that you can make a deeper run? I think we feel we can make a deeper run anyway. I mean, we, I mean, because we always, except for my freshman year, really, you know, we've been pretty good in tournaments. So, I mean, we was pretty good in Mallory of the year. Yeah, I mean, we lost to West Virginia that year, the same year, by buzzer beater. Last year was kind of, so, so, you know, so, I mean, we got confidence, you know, playing in terms of the set. Cash and, and SK both, does, does this start to wipe away some of what happened last night, seeing your name go up on the bracket? Uh, well, I guess Jancy told me to forget about it. So I, I guess that's what I got to do. Mm. And that's all we can do. The brackets is the brackets. We got to get ready to play Texas. We can't worry about uh, Louisville no more. Like it's it's not it's not an issue. Yeah. Like we can't do nothing about yesterday. You can only worry about what happens Friday. Do you do everything he actually tells you to do? <laughs> I mean, yeah, that's, the, that's the man. <laughs> Do you, do you feel any different going into this tournament than you did last year? Because you've been through it once. I think so. Like I'm more calm. Last year I was kind of excited. Like you don't know what to, what to expect when you get there. Right now you know what's gonna happen. Now you're just ready for the game. SK, can you talk about that? This year's feeling compared to last year. Yeah, like Cass said, it was more. This year is more of a like a um like a common common year compared to last year. I mean. When when the thing came up on the TV last year, you see most of us dancing and everything. But, I mean, I guess this year is like, all right, we made it, but now it's type, it's business time. How do you think you guys are playing when this tournament? Maybe just compared with last year. You were playing well last year too, but um, do, you, do you feel more confident because you know the way you're playing and, and the fact that you've been there before? I, I always feel confident in, in this team. I mean, <laughs> it's like. With with us is like you can always you can always I don't know like this is is different this year a little bit but then again it's not I don't know yeah. so nobody danced in there anymore no nah, I mean <laughs> I but that's up. yeah he yeah, I did. mean <laughs> yeah you're gonna see him jump but I mean I guess and you should be <laughs> yeah, that's what Bob said <laughs> but you know. Yeah, too. What else have you told Cashmere to do? Since he's doing everything you say, apparently. Oh, no. <laughs> you got a list now? <laughs> Making one of your head? Oh, no. I think that's the first thing I ever... Play hard. Yeah, I, think, I, think, I think other than be ready to shoot the ball when I kick it to you. <laughs> other than that. <laughs> I don't know. What, what does Cashmere mean to this team? Oh, he means a lot, man. You know, he's like, he's like, our, he's our, like, I got real, real, you know, ball handling. You know, and when he's up for it, you know, I feel like he's just as good as any other team. You know, I mean, you, you see Cash play games, and you can really look at him and tell how talented he is when he's up for it. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a year ago, that UConn game, he's feeling pretty rough. Does that oh, yeah. kind of I mean, hurt we, you guys when you see? Definitely. You know, last year, like, we felt if his knee was just felt a little bit better. We'd have had a different, it'd been a different game, you know, just because of the way he can, you know, he can score the ball, he can play defense, pass the ball. So, you know, any night he can do any of those things. So, you know, that hurt us last year. SK, what's the biggest thing you guys learned from playing the tournament last year? Did you feel like you came away smarter about how to approach things because of what you guys did? Mm, yeah, I mean, I think I think with us this year, we're a lot more wiser than we was last year, and with the whole. Um, with the whole tournament last year, I mean, like it was mostly 
some of our first times there. And then, yeah, it was, yeah, actually all of us. <laughs> so, so, for it to, so for it to be like our second time now, it's like, you just gotta look at it like, I mean, we know what to expect. Did anything surprise you when you got there that things like maybe you thought it would be that took some getting used to that you'll be more prepared for now this year? Or, or was it pretty much as you expected it to be last year? Yeah, that was kind of shocking. The roadblocks on the street. When they, when they yeah, bring the, you the, to the, the cops take you to the gym. Man. Yeah. Man, when you, I thought you just had to leave early. <laughs> <laughs> and then when you finally, um, when you win, like all your um, supporters and everything, you're the back hotel waiting for you. Yeah. 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 But yeah, that's fun. During the tournament, halftime is a lot longer, the timeouts are longer. Did you guys notice that last year? No, I ain't noticed I ain't that. No the timeouts were long? Yeah. Everybody yeah. already going to come out the game. <laughs> <laughs> you get an extra 60 seconds every really? time. Yeah. Media yeah. timeouts. Yeah. They go from two to three? Um, That's good. I'm going to need that. <laughs> what is that? Um, <laughs> that's good news. The day, the day after, the, um, after the win, I guess, when we go to the gym and Shoot around and have fun with it. Yeah, that's that's fun. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> when it's open for the media, yeah, yeah, open yeah. practice. That's real. Oh, yeah. That's when we had the shootout. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Me and him had a shoot. Yeah. I'm he getting won. you this year. He won. I'm, yeah, he he got me by like one. I'm gonna get you this year. That's right. He, he gave me in a shooting competition. In a shooting competition. See, it was, what was my knockout? knockout. <laughs> I missed and then he hit his. I was like, yo, this guy, man. Now, see, what happened was he already lost down at the guard. <laughs> so he tried so to come down the heart. <laughs> <laughs> I, know, I know you guys don't like looking past Texas. How nice is it not to see a big, a big, another Big East team looming? Oh, man. I mean, you play a Big East team, y'all got the scout report on each other from the season. Especially, like, especially how late in the season we played you kind of last year, then you go right back to the tournament. Play. I mean, it was like still in conference. So we just left the Big East tournament and only played one game against, you know, a team from another conference. That, that's just, that looks good to us. Do you feel like there's an advantage playing at a conference always because you feel like the Big East is so tough, the grinder that it is for you guys? Do you mm -hmm. feel like that's a one-up on everybody no matter who they are? Well, yeah, and it depends on what conference the refs come from, too. Yeah. Yeah, you know, <laughs> 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 yeah, we get packed in real so we get out there, it's kind of rough. <laughs> it might all be fouled out. So. <laughs> I mean, it's an, I, th I think it's an advantage to us because of the, the you know, the competition every night. The you got to go play them or they're going to blow you out. It's a competition every night. Did you pay any attention to who was maybe sitting in the Sweet 16? Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> We were hoping we was on their side. Yeah, we thought we were going to be down there with them. Pittsburgh. Yeah, so before the start of the season, you talked about you didn't want it to be a one-time NCAA appearance and then not make it this year for this program. You needed to build on that. You have a sense now that doing it again, getting a six seed is another step for this program? Oh, yeah. I think it, I think it will definitely be another step if, you know, we can win more than one game. You know, that will really, you know, kind of take it up, you know, from where we was at last year. Pretty much the same point we were last year when we got to the tournament. Is it the same? Yeah. Yeah. 6'11 six, 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 playing six, a Big 12, 12 team. team. Yep. Same exact spot. So we feel like if we can you know, go a little further in the tournament, make a deeper run, then we'll be taking it to that next step. Do you feel like having come so close to winning in the Big East champion or tournament that you guys have more determination? Yeah, I think so. Because, you know, we do that, that'll really, you know, help cash and get about it. So, <laughs> <laughs> so you know, that, I think that gave us a little more motivation to, to get, you know, get back. How important, I mean, how nice is it to go to Nashville and not to be sent like to an organ to where <clears throat> on New Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we were scared of the Mexicans. I was like, Mexico, please, don't man. <laughs> we were scared. Don't was, we was like, Mexico. man, we ain't gonna have no fans. They ain't coming. <laughs> it was gonna be us and Biz too far. <laughs> <laughs> That's your reward. 
<laughs> I'm not sure I would have gone. <laughs> hey, yes, how do you think you have uh, changed as a person since the suspension? And if you have, how has that translated onto the court in your play? Oh, yeah, that's tough. I don't know. I mean, he's I always, yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty much the same. I think yeah. it's just public outlook. Yeah, the way I, because I was so much in the media then, I was like, man. <laughs> but you know, I think, I think that's just, I think that's the biggest difference. Just you know, the public. I mean, they will tell you I was always the same around them. Mm -hmm. you know, but, I, don't know, I guess it just made me less, you know. I'm a little shy, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> I'm yeah, around a bunch of people that I'm yeah. not comfortable with. But. Used to see him sweat, but he don't sweat now. <laughs> <laughs> Mick said you were wiser. You agree with that? Or the therapist. No, I think it's faster decision making. You know, you make a decision on a snap now instead of just going, which was I used to kind of live by. <laughs> you want to elaborate on that? <laughs> uh, nope. <laughs> Anything else, guys? Mm -hmm.